What is happening, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Ghost of Tsushima. This is episode number three, and I really hope you've been enjoying it thus far. Last episode, we got a bit distracted. <laughs> As I said, it's gonna happen. This is a fucking open world game. RPG, we're gonna get distracted, we're gonna get pulled off things. That's my playstyle. If you don't like it, get out. <laughs> I'm kidding. But we're gonna get through this game slowly, but we are gonna get through it and we're gonna enjoy it because this is the way I do it. I get every second of gameplay for my buck I spend. Not only that, a game is made to not only do the main story. That is how I do it. That is the way I see it. That is how we're gonna do it here. On Flip Val's channel. Hope you guys are all doing well. Like I said, this is episode three. Let us jump straight into this mission. We're with the the sensei, who is a freaking master. Uh, uh, what would you call it? Archer. <sighs> and we're going. Is it Ishikawa? Yes. We're with uh, Sensei Ishikawa, and we're gonna go help find his uh, student, I believe. What, what did he call it? His student? Something like that. Archery student. There we go. And uh, we're hoping to recruit him into our alliance to take on the Mongols to get our uncle back. So that is what we are doing right now. Let's who go, Sensei. Out of Kumuda? No one knows. Are there any others who can fight back? Besides us? I don't know yet. You'd better find out quickly. We can't free your uncle by ourselves. Uh, no. <laughs> we cannot do that. Come on, dog. Where we? Oh. I can help track your student. I need no help tracking Tomoe. Tomoe? A woman? From what clan? No clan. A peasant. But she can outshoot any samurai I know. <laughs> Even you, Sakai. If you're saying that, Mr. Master, I believe you. The last you're time dark. I saw you was ten years ago. You came to study with me. You remember? I remember most of the students I reject. Instead, you took this Tomoe as your student. You showed promise. Tomoe is a prodigy. Mongols, take them. Looking for me? See you later. Whoa, moly. Oh, I knew it was gonna happen. Bastard. Oh, shit. See you later. They fight like drunk Tanuki. They fought well enough at Komoda. Even Tanuki can catch a tiger when it's sleeping. Okay, let's plug this bastard in quickly, guys. Give me a second. The moist trail picks up here. Come! There we go. Okay. Double check. Yep. Well, yeah, dog. The Mongols took Fort Nakayama. That patrol likely came from there. That's close to the hot springs. The town will be the next to fall. Sounds like he's in this area. Where are you, dude? Something happened here. I'm going this way, Sakai. Uh, 
I wasn't sure where the hell you were going, man. The heck? Ambush. Look around. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> this way we were. Why didn't you follow, bud? What's going on? Rice and millet. Left uneaten. The attack was sudden. Oh, she's definitely not a samurai. Samurais Blood. are never surprised. Not much. No one died. A Japanese quiver. A gift to my greatest student. I fear the worst. Or Firefly there. Super cool. Super duper cool, really. Get my mic a little closer so we can get some deep voice going. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. The Moya would never leave the quiver behind. Unless she was pursued. Or captured. To what end? Interrogation. Torture. Worse. They may be doing the same to Lord Shimura. Fear is a weapon, Sakai. Do not let the Mongols use it against you. Your student. Where would they take her? Fort Nakayama. The fort oh. is nearby. I should have fought that Komura with you. Better you didn't. We lost enough there. Why did the samurai fail? The Mongols fought like animals. Wrong answer. I saw it with my own eyes. An archer's aim relies not on eyes, but on body, mind, and spirit. Transition to night. It's freaking beautiful. Stop here. We need to talk. What's wrong, Sensei? This bow was a gift to me from Lord Nagao many years ago. It's a beautiful weapon. Of course it is. And there's nothing more painful to me than a perfect bow ineptly used. Then it's a good thing you're giving it to me. <sighs> Who said anything about giving? Prove you can shoot straight. I'll let you borrow it. Try it out before we go into battle. Borrow it. I love that. Half bow. Okay. Moderate damage and draw speed. Okay. Once a gift from Lord Nago. Nago? Yeah, Nago. Don't want to mess these names up, so please forgive me. To Sensei Ishikawa. Now wielded by the Sensei's new student. Well, it's not really us, is it? <laughs> Holy crap, that thing sucks. <laughs> that is that is yeah level five is yeah speed is good range sucks ass it is a half bow though even though it's huge <laughs> that made me in the end that's how much it costs it's uh i wonder if you can jump straight if you have the resources if you can jump straight to that um to there wax wood Okay, so, yeah. A lot of exploring to find those things. Aim for that lamp closest to us. The further the target, the more your arrow drops. Now the one further down the road, on the left. Bad. Let's see if you can hit the one furthest away. I don't think it's three, is it? Focus, Sakai. I'm getting used to the grip. How does it feel? Like it was made for me. It wasn't. So take good care of it. Let's go. Okie dokie. One hour like this would have helped at Komodo. It is a good bow. But victory is won by warriors, not weapons. You haven't seen the Mongols fire weapons. And they have not yet won. Oh no, arrows, okay. 
Okay, 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 I see. Change your arrow types. Uh, we, we're still learning, we're still learning. Um, how do you see? There we go. Fort Nakayama. I hope your student is inside. We'll get a better look at the defenses from up there. And get some bamboo, bro. All about that. This spot is perfect. I'll find a way in. Open the gate. Then we hit them. You always charge into battle with your Hakama half tied? You have a better idea? Patience, Sakai. The Mongols will send men to find their missing patrol. When they open the gates, we strike. The longer we delay, the longer Tomoe remains in danger. She can take care of herself. Survey the battlefield. What can we use to our advantage? Hornet nests. One shot could stir them up. Mm, the Mongols will face the sting of insects and arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. We'll find out. An arrow in those hanging lights will kick up sparks. <laughs> and start fires. Yeah, but it's raining. They have many archers. They're skilled, but we are better. When the gates open, distract the enemy and rain arrows on their heads. Then we storm the fort and free Tomoe. Good. Now we wait. They're opening the gates. Wait for my signal. I waited shit long. I sucked That's at that. Tomoe. I really sucked at that. Anyway, let's pick up some of these things they've dropped. Oh, just arrows, really? Most of them arrows? All arrows. 
eight. We can only hold eight. That's, uh... That sucks. <laughs> that does suck, I won't lie. Whoa, view, view, view. Oh, I can't see. I can't see you. Uh, I'm 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 still used to freaking um, Assassin's Creed. I'm still used to the Assassin's Creed parrying where he knocks the shield and you've got to wait a bit. That's really messed me up with parrying, because that's like the game that has the most parrying that I play, because I'm not really a Dark Souls fan. So, that has really uh, made things difficult for me in this. Come on, pop your head up. I didn't know you could pull the the bow back that much. I kept shooting on slain prisoners. Shit. Tied up. <laughs> Killed with arrows. Tomoe isn't. Wait, this pendant belongs to her. Search the fort. Oh shit, back into gameplay. Sometimes you're like, uh... One arrow, yeah, I need to pick up some freaking ammo for my arrows, man. These guys should have some on them. No? Oh, come on. Whiskers. A scroll. Archery terms with Mongolian translations. Your name is mentioned. She was teaching them my way of the bow. I don't think by choice, bud.
Apparently they couldn't have learned too much in a few days. I know this contrast looks good. I'm going to play a little bit long, a little bit longer. I'm going to put it off for a little bit to see because I know it's set to dramatic, but sometimes it's so dark, man. That That's already better. I mean, it does look really good with uh, the sunlight and stuff, but it's really, you run into buildings and you're like, what? I can't see anything with massively bright. I mean, if I, if I had HDR on and stuff, it probably would look amazing, but you, I can't, you know, I can't. Doesn't work. Someone's personal quarters. A woman's kimono. Tomoe's kimono. The Mongols freed her. Why? Wanted her to teach them shit, dude. Obviously. Nice little room she's got here. In many ways, I don't think she had a chance. Yeah, if there's um. So I can't record HDR on this because it doesn't work um, with this Elgato. The HDR recording um, software built in doesn't work with Mac, only on um, PC, which I think is complete bullshit. But hey, it is what it is. So I bet it. I bet this uh, dramatic, dramatic contrast thing setting would look amazing. But yeah, I mean outside. Contra set to dramatic. That looks really good. I love that. But when we run inside, it's just... It's so much darker. Although it is quite realistic in some ways, so... Oh, it just looks good like this. I'm going to leave it on. <laughs> I was going to leave it off. But it just... The colours and everything just look so much better with it on, so... We'll put up with it being dark in some places to have the lighting outside and that fire outside and that the shadows just looks beautiful uh do we have any have these guys got screwed really those are some big arrows though Jeez. these arrows are japanese they're tomoe's arrows you are sure I taught her to make the knock with deer horn. And that curve of the eagle feathers. So the Mongols took her weapons? The shots are tightly clustered. No Mongol shoots Japanese arrows with such skill. Huh. Then they allowed her to use a bow. Yeah, guys, haven't you figured out they were trying to get her to teach Need them? That. A survivor. Help. Please! It's so cold! <laughs> We're looking for a woman, an archer. The Mongols caged her with us. But they set her free, gave her armor and a bow. She killed my wife and the others. The bodies we found. She proved her skill to the enemy, and they recruited her. Please, it, it hurts. Leave me. You're gonna die, bud. Sorry. I've seen enough. Let's go. <clears throat> Looking for more arrows, man. Where are you at, bro? What happened? I pushed her too hard. Pushed her how? What are you hiding? Where Sensei? are you? I don't know where this dude is. How is his voice down the bottom there, but he's over here? What the? Oh, shit. Okay, it's like a little sneaky thing. Now, let's go into this tower and see. I got some more arrows, good. Are 
I demand an answer. She attacked me. Not bandits. Tomoe. Why? She has no idea what it means to be samurai. You drove her to the Mongols. Do not judge me. Do not lie to me. I can't let Tomoe teach my way of the bow to the enemy. Then we will stop her. This is my fight. I don't need your weapon. No, you need me. Victory is won by warriors, not weapons. Lord Shimura raised you well. We'll hunt them away together, but we do it my way. And when the time comes, you will help rescue my uncle. You have my word, Sakai. I will prepare to hunt Tomoe. When you are ready, meet me at my dojo. We can't rescue my uncle alone. I need more people to join our fight. Fine lady Masako Adachi. If she's still alive, she's one of the finest warriors on the island. <laughs> Being cheeky. <laughs> I love it. Finally, you have learned a technique point. You see, I should have a free technique point from the bonus content. That's not under understanding. From the... I'm going to go check something, guys. So I'm going to pause this. Okay, guys. So I've got to pick one of these. I meant to have... Meant to have one. Free one. With the... Um, deluxe edition. But I don't think I do. Oh well, we're gonna we're gonna get uh, perfect parry. That's happening. Okay, there we do. Oh yeah, we do. See, we have three. Okay, we leveled up twice, and then we get our free one. Never mind. That's cool. Stance. Okay, okay, okay. So this is best for shield breaking. Swordsman, shieldman. Defeat two more Mongolian leaders to unlock. Oh, okay. Okay. That's pretty cool. That's insane. We can't even see it, okay. Ghost. Yeah, boy, ghost. What have we got here? Iron will.
Ah, oh, that is awesome. Extra resolve. Hmm, very cool. What one was this again? Um, hold and then tap, okay. I don't think we're gonna go for that straight away. What we got here? Perfect healing parry. Perfect parry is looking for small amounts of health. That's awesome. Parry an unblockable attack from a Mongolian sword. That's pretty cool. This is deflect arrows. Oh. That's awesome. Oh, we want that. Hmm. Yeah, we want perfect dodge, but I think right now... I think we're gonna go for perfect healing parry. I think we, we want some health. I think we want some health from it, guys. That is the way it should be done. Weapons and ammo. Okay. Yeah, 16 is better. Okay. We don't have any ghost weapons yet, so... Okay. Let's go and do this for focused hearing. Although, saying that, actually, guys, I've heard of around here, yeah, there's supposedly being a charm. We're going to head here. This is just from a short clip I've watched from a. Uh, Another content creator I very much enjoy, namely Fighting Cowboy. But those gold birds you need you need to follow. They take you to something good. Come on. 
Come on, dog. Well, there you go. Whoa. We need to get up there to a hot spring. I will take that. Flower, yep. Do a little rest quickly. After we gather this charm, guys, we're going to end the episode. That is the plan. Reflect. You should be here, Uncle. When the island's free, we'll spend a week soaking in these waters. Oh, those hot springs, natural hot springs must be amazing. I was meant to go to Japan in December for a show. I doubt that's happening though, which is sad. Look at the world. Ah, oh. we'll get into some snow. I love how they run holding their sword. It's so sick. Samurai were awesome warriors. So You are boss, bro. What's happening? Opa. Up you go, bud. There's somebody to speak to, yeah. Hey, dude. What's happening? Let me chat to you. Have you seen the birds, Lord Sakai? What birds are you looking for? The golden ones. Songs that remind you of more peaceful times. Ah, oh, they were my mother's favorite. She used to say they knew our island better than any other creature. I believe it, my lord. If it weren't so dangerous, I'd follow one. See where the golden bird leads me. Maybe I'll do just that. But you should wait until our home is safe once more. I will, Lord Sakai. Thank you. Well, there you go. <laughs> you do a bit of exploring and it tells you follow the golden bird. And that's how we ended up getting up here, so... It's like, ah, it makes sense to follow those little guys. Can we go down? Thank you. Yeah, not much resolve. <laughs> Look like he went up here. Lots of flowers, that's sick. It's where there's meant to be a shrine around here. Yeah. No, no, it's further. Okay, well we found the um Ooh, careful, bud. I'm onto that bamboo for sure. Five hundred and sixty meters. Really going the right way, are we? <laughs> oh, Lee Cow. We get down here. Yeah. 
There we go. There you go, bud. Let's rock and roll. Oh my. Yeah, this is kind of the direction I want to be going. Come on, dude. Let's roll. That was really cool jumping off the horse onto the wall like that. Very cool dynamic. Cool, we found a shrine. Just what I was looking for. The heck was that? Was that a goat? It was a deer thing. Jeez, I was like, what was that? Frog or toad, I don't want to get it wrong and offend anyone. What a jump, dude. What a jump. Oh, get away from that. It's pitch <clears throat> black. Come on. Go forward, dude. There we go. Yeah, that seems to be a problem that that keeps happening. Very dark. We go. Squeeze through, bud. Nice. I'm gonna try something if this works and instant save <laughs> I wonder if you can do a hopscotch Nope, not what I wanted to do, holy moly. I wanted to try going up and he just kind of jumped and let go. That sucked. <laughs> C can we load? Oh no, okay. Yeah, come on. No, go go left. What was it doing there? Some weird 
there's little little niggles in the game where your controls don't really do what you want them to so I'm pretty sure uh, I, w I would expect by Monday with there to be an update to sort that stuff out Yes, little little things and controls not being as sharp as they could be personally But I mean that's that's some stuff, you know in some systems it could be fine on others it could give some issues, so I think it's more of a uh, Teething process, you know with a game with such a big open world and that a lot to focus on all the different dynamics too so it's not end of the world it's not something i would go oh my launch day this should be perfect there's a lot of po lot lots of the game that is great okay that didn't do what i was hoping it would do i was hoping he would jump on the branch but i think that's where i came from okay now it's all of a sudden coming night which is a bit annoying Nope, oh, okay, so you can't grab on there. <laughs> Just checking. Not possible to be done. That's better, now it's day again, okay. Restart, for, save and restart from last checkpoint, and there you go, that changes time of the day. Done. Um, is this where I need to be? Very pretty. Very damn pretty. I'll tell you that much. Uh, it's longer than I want this to be. Definitely longer than I want this to be. Why is this? This isn't that tricky to figure out, is it? That's where I came from, so we definitely want to go up. Come on, what are you doing, dude? Yeah, this goes here. We definitely need to go up. I really like the climbing style, it looks really good. Go that way. Well, I, I, I feel like you need to come this way for some reason. I'm missing something. Why am I confused here? To <laughs> her. It's probably obvious to somebody watching this and they're like, oh, you should just go here. And I'm like, 
That is not it. <gasps> not what I wanted to do was hopefully... I was wanting to try and get that branch. I think that's where we freaking came from. That's the annoyance. That is the annoyance. What I might do, guys, is actually give this a pause, figure out where to go, and then cut to that. So, yeah, it's already 51 minutes, so let me do that. So, guys, I think I got it. I think we had to drop down and come down here. Drop down from the top there. You know where we went run and climbed up? I think we needed to drop down and come... <gasps> come across here I think that's what we needed to do it took me longer than I'd like to admit <laughs> to finding that Problem going through there that time. Oh, was worried he wasn't gonna grab on there. <laughs> Up you get, yeah. Whoa, not what I wanted to happen. Why did you jump so skew? Dude. There we go. But I feel this is the way, yeah, this is the way to the beginning. Oh my gosh, really? No, we haven't been yet, have we? I don't think so, no. No, we haven't been here. Yeah. Second I thought we had. Dude, what are you doing? I was getting a little stuck. Run. What a sick view. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, look at that. Probably the oh yeah, no way you ain't in the water. Beaches. What an island in Japan, man. Wowza. Absolutely wow. Look at that. My goodness. If there was ever a thumbnail for a game, that is it right there. Holy cow. Beautiful. Very cool. I also know where there's another charm that allows you to get extra resources and stuff when you pick them up and collect. So I don't know if it makes you get two wax there instead of one. That, that guy over there. Wow. So cool. Absolutely beautiful, this game. Absolutely amazing. I 
want you to face that way, dog. So pretty. If I'm going to use custom thumbnails, I'll probably use that. I'm not sure if I am, but I'll probably use that one for this episode. Anyway, guys, thank you so, thank you so much for joining us. I really appreciate you coming to hang out with us. I know this is a longer one, but we did uh, we did knock out some of uh, some of our mission with our sensei Ishikawa. We knocked out the first part anyway of his, and then we came to get. I didn't even show you guys what it is gear. So this is it here. Slowly recover health when not in combat. That's really, really, really useful. Really, really useful. So we had that. Killing enemies restores a minor amount of health. I don't know if it stacks with that one. So we're going to keep this charm on for now. So thank you guys so much for coming to hang out with us. We did quite a bit in this episode. I know it was longer, longer than I wanted it to be, but that's what sometimes happens. <laughs> it's going to happen a lot, I think, in this game, but that's okay. I want to try and stick around the 40, 45 minute mark per an episode because I feel that around 30 is not enough for this game, especially being an RPG in that. 30 just won't work, I don't think. So... You're going to end up with too many episodes. I see some guys are doing like 20 to 25 and it's like, ugh. You're going you're gonna to have like a 300 episode series. But it tends to be a lot of the guys that do such short um, episodes, they'll mainly be doing main story and that's it. That's not how we do things. Anywho, not going back into it. But thank you for stopping by. Remember, as I always say, if you're going out in the world, be mindful of COVID, especially for other people not just you it's people you could infect that could suffer not you so be mindful of that please and yeah that being said one last time thank you for spending your time with me i really appreciate it so much and we'll catch you in the next one guys thank you cheers <laughs>